Hello! This week's video is about being social, about getting involved with something, taking up a hobby that gets you out of the house and mixing with other people. We are social creatures and we thrive when we are in company of like-minded individuals. This past few months I've been involved with Sister Act the Musical and I've been taking little snippets of footage over the uh, show weeks. So here is the highlights of the last two weeks for me. Enjoy! Here we are, it's opening night tonight, so um, this little theatre here is going to be packed out with people very, very soon and I'm going to be on the stage doing my stuff with the most fabulous cast. This show has so much heart and um, it's just been the most fantastic experience. Very consuming, it's been a few nights a week and every other Sunday, but I couldn't think of a better way to spend my time. Here I am in the auditorium, got some fantastic photos up and, uh, oh, is that the director behind me? Oh, it might be. Hi, Nathan. Hi, Rob. <laughs> um, and, uh, yeah, so this is the delightful Norbury Theatre in Droitwich Spa. And here's a member of the cast, Holly, here, who is playing, playing Sister Mary Roberts and is fantastic in this show. Hi, you're nice. Yeah. Good, lovely. Hey, go and look at the photos, they're brilliant, absolutely amazing. And here is where we all gather when the show's going on on stage. So we can enter the stage from there and also from there. Um, and there's a TV monitor so we can see what's going on on stage. And uh, my dressing room is up those stairs with all the lads. I'm just about to enter the boys' dressing room, already getting a little bit of lip from uh, one of my fellow cast members. Um, also, ex-colleague over there. Hello, Mr. Bellamy. Oh, yeah, hello. You're here then. Great. Mm, yeah. So, he, I was going to say something nice because he's been our chor <laughs> choral master for the whole show, but I'm not going to bother now. Anyway, and, uh, and that's why I'm in this dressing room across the way. Yes. So, I'm, so I'm away from here. Here he comes. Mm hmm. It's because nobody else wanted to share with him. Yes. Anyway, uh, here's the glamour of, of the dressing room broken mirrors, broken mirrors, uh, and my best mate made me a card which is lovely and yeah that's my little stuff my little peppermint tea it's to a great run makeup is on and we've got 10 minutes before curtain up so um as you can see i'm playing a cop in this sweaty eddy it's the interval such a good crowd really enjoying it they're getting all the jokes um having a blast it's great um yeah it was a fantastic night last night. The audience were up and dancing at the end. Uh, it was just great. There were only three tickets left and sold, so it was pretty much a sellout. Tonight is sold out. Tomorrow night sold out. And then we get a little break. Um, and I'm going to take some footage of uh, what goes on in the wings during a production, because it might be interesting for you to see if you don't know. I'm exhausted, but I'm having the time of my life. Right, start picking the feet up so the knees start coming a little higher. Try and bring your knees up over your trousers again. Three, four. I like the flowers, I like the daffodils, I like the mountains, I like the rolling hills, I like the fireside when the lights are low, singing a do up a do up a do up a do. And I'm ready. I'm all made up, time to head down to the stage. <gasps> Stage. MDs come to join us, and uh, Monsignor and uh, Pablo. No one has a clue what he says because he's Spanish apparently. Of nuns. 
In the wild, they run free. They run fast. They run joyously. They knock things over. It's start of the second week and we have a full sellout week. I thought I'd show you where the theatre is. It's, it's that little little entrance there and it's part of this wonderful Art Deco block of flats which actually used to be a hotel. There we go, so the Norbury Theatre, here it is, that's the entrance. And um, you can actually see some of the beautiful features. I mean, this is just stunning, absolutely stunning. Love it. Anyway, off to the dressing room to go and get ready. There is a less glamorous side to uh, theatre, and uh, it's a bit like being in Skid Row. Oh, another musical I did. Yes, Little Trouble of Horrors. In fact, the last musical that I did here. What do you call a group of nuns? What's the collective term? I don't know. last night and it's the interval and we're just having a little bit of fun we've had some cake and uh, there's a secret Santa going on and I got some stained glass window socks yay the show is over it's done back to uh, normality the routine I had before uh, it's been the most fantastic fantastic experience I've never been in a show that has had so much love, so much love. The finale song is called Spread the Love and wow, it, it really, really was. I've had the most amazing time and um, despite contracting laryngitis, uh, got through it and um, it's just been a wonderful experience. So look, if you are looking for something to do, then get in contact with your local amateur theatre group. They are all over the place. There are so many of them, and it doesn't matter if you don't want to perform, there's plenty of stuff to do and get involved with, whether it's front of house duties during the run of a show, whether it's helping out backstage with props, costume, whether it is actually performing. Or if you're musical, then join the band, get involved with that. Getting involved with a group such as an amateur theatre group it allows you to interact with other people who are all working toward a common goal and having fun, having a lot of fun doing it. That's it, so I'm gonna go and rest my voice and uh, I hope you've enjoyed this Sister Act special. Please remember to subscribe to this channel. Uh, you can find all my social media links in the description below this video and I will catch up with you next week. You take care now, bye.